Hello, YouTube. Um, so on, whenever I posted that cell phone video of depressingness, um, playlists were trending down. I got blood drawn on Wednesday. Is that the day I ever posted that video? I don't even know. Um, got blood drawn on Wednesday. Platelets were at 14,000, which is very low. I kind of already knew there were lots of symptoms, petechiae in different places, which it's looking a little better maybe so what they do is i'm already taking a drug which i've at least talked about a little bit before um i'm already taking a drug to deal with the platelet problem the problem is that drug isn't doing enough so they have put me on a short course of steroids uh the particular steroid is called dexamethasone it's very similar to prednisone with dexamethasone, they give you a 40 milligram dose for four days, so it's a very high dose of steroids. That part isn't so bad. I don't tend to get too many bad side effects from steroids. Lots of people get lots of bad side effects. My side effects tend to be relatively mild. I do find with the dexamethasone, I get blurry vision, cut not all over like distance vision becomes blurry for about two weeks i'm hoping that this time that's not going to happen because part of the reason i think that happens is um my blood sugar goes insane on steroids i've talked about that in a video before too the problem is even these short course steroids seem to cause my blood sugar to go high and they, it stays high for a while so this time my endocrinologist gave me insulin to take while I'm taking the steroids. The insulin didn't come in, so I'm taking a slightly different insulin that I happened to still have. So it's a longer-acting insulin. I took four units yesterday when I took the steroids, and I tracked my blood sugar, and the four units did not seem to do enough. So today I'm up to 10 units, and we're going to see if that does anything. 10 units is actually the most insulin I've ever injected in one sitting. Um... I think. Uh, so yeah, that's what's happening in my life. Um, taking some insulin, checking my blood sugar every so often, which some people are afraid of like finger sticking and stuff, but I've kind of gotten used to it and I really don't even feel it anymore. Either that or my fingertips are just numb from life. Um, I don't think that's true. Um, I use insulin pens for the most part, so I have really tiny needles, which is great because don't have a lot of fat to inject into. But these two, the two times I've done this so far, it hasn't really been that bad. Either that or my pain tolerance is much higher now. Um, get blood drawn a lot, so it makes up for it a little bit. So yeah, I've just been tracking the blood sugar, hoping. Um, that I can get the insulin amount right to kind of... So the thing is, I'm still making insulin. I'm just not making enough to counteract the steroids. Or the steroids are suppressing my pancreas, one of the two. So hopefully, I can get the right insulin amount to cancel that out. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Hopefully, the steroids bring the platelets back up. Hopefully, they stay up for a while. It's possible that what's going to happen is I'm just going to have to, every two months or so, have a steroid pulse um, along with the drug I already take. So we'll see. It's a mystery disease and people don't know stuff. But just an update on what's going on and that's kind of all I got.